this will probably be another video since it is a different trail this is my first time visiting this trail so whatever you guys see for the first time will also be whatever i see for the first time it is called william granger greenway and it spans through courtright center for conservation and it is right above and it's right above Boyd Conservation Park, which we visited in the last video. But it's a little bit longer, it is 13 kilometers. Uh, we probably won't do the whole trail, we will just probably end right at Major Mackenzie Drive. So yeah, let's not wait any longer and let's hit this trail. this place is actually massive I had no idea it was this big there's also so much forest here pardon my red face I get very red when I exercise or when it's really hot this trail is very hilly um, a lot of the time I just wasn't able to film just because I was going super fast down or very slow walking up the hill yeah not many fields and also not many benches so this trail doesn't have many picnic spots of forests, lots of nature. So unlike the previous trail that we visited in the last video, Boyd, uh, Boyd Park, this trail you can't really see the river from the trail itself. You kind of have to step away from the trail a bit and go through the grass or the trees. And I found it. I didn't know. <laughs> I, I kind of forgot that there was even a river on this trail, but it's the same Humber, Humber East River that you know, spans Boyd Park as well as Courtright Center for Conservation. There's another little descent to the river. I like seeing water because it reminds me that there's water amidst all this heat. And we finally approached Major Mackenzie Drive. This is where we're gonna turn back. So guys, as we made it to the end of this trail, we didn't make the full trail because um, we stopped before Major Mackenzie Drive, but this trail is so long. It basically goes along East Humber River, which is a very long river. Uh, it goes 
very far up north, uh, northwest. Uh, if you love exploring forests, this is perfect for you because there, I saw so many little paths that um, went off the trail and into the forest. I didn't go into them because I do have a bike and I'm not hiking today. What struck me the most about this trail is the beautiful view that you see uh, during the beginning of it. I'll insert a short clip of it just to remind you guys. Uh, I also loved the little hills that you have to climb up and then drive or walk back down because it gives you a little bit of variance in terms of speed and, you know, excitement. I love also seeing a little river as I'm driving by. You do have to go a little bit off the trail to see it, as I mentioned before. But yeah, not many benches, um, not many people either. And yeah, that's about, that's, those are kind of my highlights for this one. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know if you have any specific trails you'd want me to check out and yeah, see you at the next one. Bye bye!